Hey everyone, I'm Yuto and today on Statue I'm going to show you how to make a delicious and nutritious chicken miso soup called Torijiru. Let's get started. So I've already greased my pot and I'm going to start by rendering a piece of chicken skin over low heat. This is an optional step but it adds amazing flavour to the soup and also leaves you with a crispy topping you can sprinkle over the top at the end. I flipped it halfway through but after about 10 minutes it should look something like this. So remove it from the pan and place it on a piece of kitchen paper to absorb the excess oil. Now we're going to add about 300 grams of chicken thigh cut into bicep pieces and brown them in the rendered fat. Once they're browned on the outside, add half a thin sliced onion, half a tablespoon of finely diced ginger, one finely diced garlic clove, and a generous sprinkle of salt. Fry these together for a few minutes until fragrant and the onion is slightly softened. Next we're gonna add the root vegetables. I've been soaking one sliced burdock root in water to prevent discoloration. So drain that and add it in. Then add one sliced carrot and about one third of a daikon radish, thinly sliced and cut into quarters. Mix those around and fry for a few minutes so they can absorb some of that chicken flavour. Okay, that looks good. So now I'm adding one litre of dashi stock. If you're interested in making your own dashi stock, I also have a video for that on my channel. Next, add some enoki mushrooms and sliced negi, also known as Japanese leeks. Drizzle with a tablespoon of sake and then gently mix. I probably should have used a larger pot here, but it just about fits. We're gonna mix just to almost boiling, then lower the heat, cover with a lid, and simmer until the root vegetables are softened to your liking. I don't like mine too soft, so for me, it this takes about 15 minutes. While I'm waiting, I'm just gonna cut the chicken skin into thin strips. This is gonna be the topping, but it also makes a great snack. Okay, let's see how it's coming along. This looks good to me, so I'm just gonna turn off the heat and add one teaspoon of soy sauce. Then finally, we're gonna add the miso. I used about four tablespoons, but depending on the brand or your preference, you can use more or less. Miso paste doesn't dissolve well, so you need to break it up before you incorporate it into the soup. That's where this mesh strainer comes in, really handy. It makes sure there aren't any lumps of miso paste in the soup. If you don't have this or anything similar, pour a few tablespoons of soup into a small bowl with the miso and whisk them together before pouring them back into the soup. Okay, all the miso has dispersed into the broth, so let's dish up. Use a ladle to scoop it up and pour it into serving bowls. Make sure you get a good amount of vegetables and chicken in each portion. Top it with some chopped green onion and the crispy chicken skin. And there you have it, delicious, comforting and nutritious torijiru with crispy chicken skin topping. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you wish to read the written recipe at your own pace or check out alternative ingredient ideas, you can find them on my blog. The link is displayed on the screen now. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Take care.